you know, when I first heard of it, I thought it was just a sort of a, a very hipster thing, you know, just a, you know, mobile handmade sauna that could go anywhere. I'm Ben Pierce. Melissa Kidak. So we met through the mobile sauna and, <laughs> and the rest is history. Yeah. We actually, we didn't meet in the sauna, so we were both fully clothed. I was a travel nurse and when I got back from LA, I came back in February, so I needed something to get me through the rest of the winter. And I jumped on the sauna wagon and then in walked Ben. And just had a very deep conversation and looked at each other in the eyes for a very long time. And then we didn't get each other's numbers. I sort of feel like the first moment when I walk into a sauna is like when, if I'm coming into a movie late. You know, it's like it's dark in there, there's all these people who are already sitting, who have already kind of connected, and I'm sort of interrupting. It's, it's a much more homey environment. You know, there, you can go with friends if you'd like. And it tends to be a little bit more social than, you know, than a gym sauna. It's not just physical warmth, but it's this warmth that comes from being in a community together, um, close. It's certainly very intimate. Yeah, it, it helped me build new community when I came back. And so I have a few good friends that I just met through the sauna. What do you appreciate about winter in general? I don't like winter here, actually. And it has taken me some time to learn to like it. And it's because of the community and the job and, and just that Minneapolis is a great place to live. As long as people have lived in areas where there's winter, they've had to deal with the fact that it's, it's harder to be together. And so how do we make that happen? It's really interesting to see something like the sauna, which is an old idea, but to take it and to you know, twist it slightly so that it fits in a way in our modern life a little bit better. Mm -hmm.